Rayleigh scattering is a phenomenon that occurs when light interacts with matter. It's an important concept in various fields including atmospheric science, astronomy, and telecommunications. But what is it, how does it work, and what are some of its practical applications? Rayleigh scattering is a process in which light is scattered by particles that are much smaller than the wavelength of the light. This process was first described by the British scientist Lord Rayleigh in the late 19th century. Rayleigh scattering is responsible for the blue color of the sky, the red color of sunsets, and the hazy appearance of distant mountains. Rayleigh scattering occurs when light waves pass through a medium that contains particles smaller than the wavelength of the light. The particles scatter the light in all directions, with the amount of scattering dependent on the size of the particles and the wavelength of the light. Shorter wavelengths, such as blue light, are scattered more than longer wavelengths, such as red light. This is why the sky appears blue during the day, as blue light is scattered more than other colors. At sunrise and sunset, the sun's light must pass through more of the Earth's atmosphere, causing the blue light to be scattered away, leaving only the red and orange colors to be seen. Rayleigh scattering has many practical applications in various fields. One important application is in atmospheric science, where Rayleigh scattering is used to study the properties of the Earth's atmosphere. By analyzing the scattered light, scientists can determine the amount of various gases in the atmosphere, such as nitrogen, oxygen, and water vapor. Another practical application of Rayleigh scattering is in astronomy. When light from a star passes through the Earth's atmosphere, it is scattered by the particles in the atmosphere. This scattering causes the star's light to appear dimmer and redder than it would if the light had not passed through the atmosphere. Astronomers can use this phenomenon to study the properties of stars and the composition of the Earth's atmosphere. Rayleigh scattering also plays an important role in telecommunications. Fiber optic cables, which are used to transmit information over long distances, rely on Rayleigh scattering to work. The glass fibers in these cables are designed to scatter light in a controlled way, allowing the information to be transmitted without significant loss. In summary, Rayleigh scattering is a process in which light is scattered by particles smaller than the wavelength of the light. It causes the blue color of the sky and the red color of sunsets. Rayleigh scattering is also used in various fields such as atmospheric science, astronomy, and telecommunications. By understanding Rayleigh scattering, we can gain insights into the properties of our world and develop innovative solutions to real-world problems.